Turn off the rain. Hi, seagull. Hi. Government employed seagull for sure. Watching the Americans every move. Yeah. This is totally not a government employed seagull. And I'm totally triple vaxxed and wearing a mask. Okay, they're gone. Get a blue V. What's a V? What the fuck is a V chat? Oh, this? It's an energy drink. Blue? All right, let's try a blue V. Thank you. Thank you, boss. You too. That's decent. Not as good as y'all made it seem. Check how much caffeine that has. It's probably an insanely unhealthy amount. You know who I am, bro? Caffeine doesn't affect me. Blue V is a go, bro. What do you mean? Yeah, it's an energy drink and it's... It's all right, bro. I mean, I agree with you. This thing is, uh, this thing's pretty good. How we doing, Brent? Off to University of Melbourne. How you doing, boss? Foreign exchange student. I'm here for James O'Keefe. He's a renowned film teacher. Oh, okay. Yes, sir. Oh, very good. Newly arrived to Australia. Where'd you come from? U.S. Oh, did you? Yeah, I got sick of that shit over there, man. Whereabouts in the U.S.? U.S.? Whereabouts? Florida. Yeah, a bunch of pussies. <laughs> <laughs> doing pretty well uh, compared to some... Don't. Yeah, yeah, they are, they are, but there's no good film stuff there. You know, they got a lot, they got a lot of medicine stuff because they have, you know, you always hear another drug story down there. Some medicine in Florida is real strong, but the film stuff isn't. How are you doing? Yeah, all right, all right. You, you know, seem like you're having a good day. It's so boring compared to your life. Really? Oh, you're traveling on the side of the world, starting to be one of the movie director or star or something. So I'm doing, you know how Australia has, has like that check-in thing? Yep. Yeah, well, so we don't have that in Florida, right? It's the complete opposite. So I'm doing a documentary this whole year on what it's like being surveilled 24 hours a day. <laughs> so that's why I have the camera on me. <laughs> yeah, it's like what the effects are of like the government watching you, etc. Studying like government seagulls and stuff with the cameras. What do you think of those? Oh, I think it's terrible. I hate it. The government seagulls or the check-in? The what the? The government seagulls? You know, like the seagulls that the that are on the beach? Oh. You know, some of them are electric, right? Seagull. I mean, that's how we have them in the U.S. I'm, I don't know if Australia is the same, but there's a few. Yeah, you can. They do a pretty good job at hiding them. I didn't know that. What? What? They look like a seagull. Yeah, it's just a, a seagull. Camera. Yeah, it's just a seagull. It's a robot seagull. Like they replace one of the eyes. You have one of those? I mean, I don't know if you do in Australia. There hasn't been any conspiracies yet. But they have them in the U.S. Yeah, yeah, they have them in like the the more like the crazy areas, California, New York, just to make sure people are wearing their masks and shit. Why do you think they steal your fish and chips? <laughs> so they can get a closer shot. Notice it next time. Notice next time you're eating chips on a, on the beach. And they pull up, look at one of their eyes. It's a different color. <laughs> you got me worried there. You ever seen a baby seagull? No. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> Makes you think. See a lot of characters driving Uber? There's... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Look up. You know, all, all, all sorts, yeah. But I'm not one, right? <laughs> <laughs> So it's basically like testing the mental effects of being surveilled 24 hours a day. It's like I have, like I have a live feed to like a custom website that I have that, so that my professor has access to. Like a live feed yeah. that my professor can access at any time just to make sure that I'm like continuing the project, etc. Oh really? Yeah. Well you say live feed. He, he can't see you but he can see... No, he can see me. Me. he can see me. Yeah, whatever the camera's pointing at. So right now it's pointing at me. So he can see me. I guess you turn it off when you go to the toilet. Yeah, I just leave it. <laughs> it's a good mental exercise though, you know? But I can make it through six months of that. I guess I fucking passed my senior project, right? There are a lot of people in America now thinking that maybe, maybe Mr. Trump wasn't so bad after all. Yeah, trust me. <laughs> we miss him. That's how the world ends. As soon yeah, as one well, nuke is launched. Like a quote from Albert Einstein. He said, he said, uh, something along these lines, I'm paraphrasing, but he goes, I don't know which weapons will be used for the next world war, but the one after it will be fought with sticks and stones. There was also another quote from Albert Einstein. Yeah, but that one, it was, it was a little different. It was less intelligent. He said, any bitches want me. What? I don't think he said that. <laughs> yeah, maybe he did it. Huh? <laughs> hey, oh, that's, uh, but it would have like been a, a smart quote. <laughs> This semester for now, but I'll probably extend. A lot of fine women here. <laughs> <laughs> How long you in America? have you lived in America then? Uh, most of my life. Yeah. I just, uh, I used to spend like three months in the Middle East every year. Oh, do you? Family oh, businesses. Family yeah, family businesses and such. You married or? Me? No. Hell no. <laughs>
find my wife here. You reckon? Yeah. Eh, you know, a wife for six months. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> An overseas wife. So your family's got a business. Yeah. So you're involved in that or? You ever, small business. You ever heard of BP? You what? You ever heard of BP? What's BP? That's their business name. It's like a, it's like a small oil company. Oh, BP? I'm just playing. <laughs> you're joking. I was wondering if you could tell your dad to pump a bit more oil so we can get the petrol prices down a bit. Yeah, there is. Dude, yeah, let me see if you could call uh, Vladimir and tell him to <laughs> fuck off. <laughs> I'll have him ring him up. <laughs> yeah. I'll say Brent test. Yeah. Well, this is well as telling me to drop you here. Is that look right? Yeah, this um, is good. This is good. Thank you, oh, boss. You Appreciate it. You're kidding. Nah, that's the oil money, my friend. Have a oh, good one. You're serious. It is British Petroleum. Thanks for the good ride. <laughs> mate, that's too much. Oh, no, I'll build that's my... That's the biggest tip of my whole life. I'll build my dad. Oh, mate. Pleasure. Have a mate, good one, my boss. my week, my month, my year. <laughs> Have a good go. one. Thank you. Bye-bye. <laughs> that guy was good, bro. That guy was real good.